Jesus and his disciples walked to a garden called Gethsemane, a quiet place they knew and loved on the Mount of Olives. Stay here for a little while, said Jesus, while I go and pray. He took with him Peter, James, and John. My heart is full of sadness, he told them. Keep watch over me while I pray. Jesus moved a little farther off where he lay down in prayer, his face to the ground in an agony of grief. Father, take this cup of suffering from me, but I always will obey you. Let your will, not mine, be He returned to the three men, only to find them fast asleep. Could you not stay awake for just one hour? He said, please keep watch while I pray. Again, he went away to pray, and again the disciples fell asleep, for their eyes were heavy. A third time this happened. Then Jesus said, No matter, the hour has come. The traitor is here. As he spoke, Judas arrived, followed by a large number of men sent by the high priests, all armed with swords and clubs and carrying burning torches. Judas went up to Jesus and kissed him on the cheek. This was the prearranged signal. Immediately, two men seized Jesus and held him tightly. At once, Peter drew his sword and struck off the ear of one of the guards. But Jesus rebuked him. Put away your sword, he said. If I need protection, it is my Father in heaven who will protect me. He touched the man, and at once his ear was whole. 